come to work every day and I think about what I'm actually doing. I'm actually guiding people and helping people. Every day I have ever gone home, I always had contributed to the centre, which is a big part of, I think, job satisfaction. I'm actually here making people's lives better and helping out the community. Things have shifted significantly. In fact, um, we're at a place now where over 30% of our employees um, are women. And having women in corrections is exceptionally important. I think it brings in a different, um, a different lens, a different dynamic. Women do well in corrections. They tend to use their communication skills. And I think that's a huge asset in corrections. You develop an idea of what you think it is based on movies and how it's glorified, but in fact, it's nothing like that. I think people believe it's more of an aggressive atmosphere than it really is. It's a very positive environment if you let it be. We hire staff uh, for their strong communication skills and their real uh, passion to, uh, to help people to try and understand the story that's behind that individual that's just been brought into custody. They tell me what made them come into the corrections atmosphere, what they want to rehabilitate, how they want to do it. Um, very positive one-on-one -on -one conversations. We're dealing with uh, the human component, and because of that, it's never the same thing day to day. Even though you may have the same duties day to day, uh, everybody you deal with is different, and so for every day, it changes. What we need from you is to bring your skills, your experience. We'll provide the training. We offer full-time paid training and it will, it will give you the skills and the tools you need to be able to effectively and successfully do the job. As I worked through the seven weeks going through the force options and the communications, I learned that anyone can do this job with the right training and the right personality. The excellent job, the benefits are good. If you're you know, a confident individual, that has integrity and determination, I think this job is definitely for you. If you enjoy working with people and helping people and being a part of a strong team, this is definitely something you should consider. My daughter, who was seven when I started working here, would love to come and work here with me here, and I would encourage her to come work here. Uh, no, you don't have to be young to join Corrections. You can come later on. I applied here when I was 48. The average that comes through here mostly are younger, but there are the few that are older. I find that the older people have more life experiences, so it was a late start to a second career, but I enjoy it a lot. I worked in corrections about six years ago, for six years, and I took a personal leave of absence and I decided to return to corrections. I miss that career aspect, um, having the time off, the pension, benefits, all of that um, to succeed with my family. The opportunities for female correctional officers are the same as male correctional officers where you can be trained all over the facility. You start out working on the living units and then, like myself, I got to work within records and control and then you can also work in programs. It was all just about, in some ways, learning on my feet a little bit and watching what was happening around me, finding my own way to interact, reaching out to whoever I could for advice. I love it because it's exciting. It's never the same thing. I've worked probably 30 different positions. Uh, you do have a position for a year, but then the next year you can change to something different. There's also the flexibility with 10 correctional centers across the province. There's the ability to move around from one region to another, one correctional center to another. The doors are open that you can choose whatever area that you want to work in next. But in all of it, you still bring your own personality into it. It's given me the ability to work with people. I'm now a supervisor, so I can use my tools to diffuse situations and, and make a difference. This is just the best place I've ever worked, and um, anybody coming into corrections, you're going to find out that in the first week of working here. It definitely develops you as a, as a person, as an officer, and if you're not successful the first time, I would encourage you to try again. If you want to really impact uh, somebody's life in a positive way, then this is a job for you. We need more females in BC Corrections, especially in the male centers, just to expand that diversity. Be a role model, be a peace officer. Join BC Corrections and create change in your community today.